I, Francis had been talking to me about this movie for a few years, and I thought that it was, it's very interesting that it was written by an ex-CIA member. He spent about 30 years of his career at the CIA specializing in Russia-U.S. relations, so I thought already that was a really unique take. And then when I read the script, I just fell in love with it. I just thought that it was such a, it's, it's such an exciting and thrilling movie, but also very complex and and it's it's really character based. It's really based on on the human part that goes into international espionage. I mean, it was all there in the paper. I mean, it was there in the script. I mean, the character is just it, it, she's just incredible. You know, she's she's forced into a terrible dehumanizing program and is being used. And through this, she finds this strength in herself to use her mind and her intellect to get her out of, of these situations. No, I mean, there are always things on the day. If, there, if you have problems with the dialogue, you can always talk about it. But a good writer is a good writer. You know, if a, I don't believe that only females should write for females or males should write for males, you know. No, I mean, the situation that my character's put in in the movie, she's forced into a dehumanizing program. Everything that I do with my job is by choice. We're certainly not trying to make any kind of political statement with this movie. It's it's completely fictionalized. The characters are fictional. Um, you know, U.S. and the relationship between the U.S. and Russia has been fascinating for decades and has been material for books and movies for decades. So we're certainly not making a political statement with this movie.